When things run well, we often assume they run regularly, from the pistons in a car to the daily changes in the tide. But when it comes to the body, there's one important exception. And today on Spartan Health, we're gonna get into that. I'm Dr. Nada. I created the Integrative Health Program at Mass General Hospital, and I'm the founder of Sage Tonic, an innovative natural treatment and wellness toolbox. Welcome to this episode of Spartan Health. There's an interesting exception in one body mechanism that we rely on all of our lives where variability is good, and that's your heartbeat. On a small scale, a healthy heartbeat judged by the intervals between beats is anything but uniform. It can range from 0.85 second intervals to 1.35 second intervals. While it may seem crazy at first, it turns out that this variability is good. Heart rate variability, also known as HRV, is a strong indicator of health, of good mental and physical health, as well as the potential of resiliency of the body to survive problems, stressors, and illness. It's a big topic, but today I want to introduce the concept and make you aware of what it is and how it can help you both short and long term. But if you want to know more, please check out our show notes where we have a lot of medical articles and other links and resources so you can really dive in and learn more. So back to your HRV. Your heartbeat is controlled by your body's autonomic nervous system or ANS. This system runs and regulates parts of our system that are always on. Things like your breathing, your digestion, blood pressure, and heart rate. The autonomic nervous system itself is divided into two main aspects, the flight or fight response or the relaxation response. When the autonomic system is relaxed, the heartbeat becomes more variable, demonstrating resilience and flexibility. In contrast, the fight or flight version of the autonomic system is triggered by stress and it could be caused by unhealthy emotional or physical conditions. If the stress response of the autonomic system is maintained, heartbeat variability decreases as it moves to a more consistent high pitch, and that's not good. This racing heartbeat is a symptom of high stress and is also an indicator that the body is being pushed towards an unhealthy or brittle state. It makes sense then that a healthy heart rate variability would be an indicator of a person's ability to bounce back from severe illness and an indicator of that person's resilience. And indeed it is. One recent study showed that subjects suffering from cancer who had decreased heart rate variability were strongly associated with shorter survival times. This great indicator of overall health is surprisingly easy to access and read by being in tune with your body. It's essentially your pulse. And when you're feeling your pulse, you'll notice that time between heartbeats increases when you exhale and decreases when you inhale. If there are some good differences between the two, congratulations, you may have good heart rate variability. Thanks for listening to Spartan Health. I'm Dr. Nada, and I'm here every Sunday as part of the Spartan Up podcast family. Spartan Up has new episodes almost every day of the week. We give you tips and information and tools to help you stay on track. And we have interviews with inspiring high achievers every Tuesday with Joe and his team. So at Spartan, we're here for you. We're your partner in resilience training for mind, body, and spirit. Thanks for listening.